and a beautiful and moving Memorial Day tradition was observed Monday off the coast of Honolulu. Thousands of candle lanterns were placed upon the water to honor lost loved ones. Organizers say the candle represents the light in the heart that is never extinguished. For thousands of years, water has served as the source for healing, purification, and renewal. And in many traditions, fire and flames have been employed to commemorate the loss of loved ones. The annual Shinyo Lantern Floating Ceremony, one of the largest Memorial Day observances in the United States, combines both of these elements, water and fire, to generate a wide range of emotions, moments of peace, and moments of deep connection to the past, present, and future. The celebration derives its poignancy not only from this poetic heritage of water and fire, but also from a powerful combination of tradition, history, visual spectacle, music, and communal activity. In a single day, the feelings of those in attendance range from contemplative and melancholy to joyous and exuberant. Staged each year in Hawaii, the event has become enormously popular, drawing over 40,000 people to Oahu's Ala Moana Beach Park and capturing media attention worldwide. In 2011, more than 25 million people saw all or part of the event on television, the internet, and in traditional print media. The ceremony literally strikes the perfect note, a perfect balance of commemoration and celebration. It is non-denominational, yet spiritual, entertaining, yet respectful. Shinyo fire and water ceremonies have been presented not only in the United States, but also in Europe, Africa, and Asia. An important part of these events is the full engagement of a region's traditional culture and creative spirit. The physical demands of staging the event have grown to the proportions of grand opera. For two weeks leading up to Memorial Day, professional crews of production specialists set up stages, dressing rooms, truss systems for light and sound, crowd control systems, props, costumes, scenery, and a sophisticated multi-camera high-def video production facility in conjunction with the CBS affiliate KGMB-TV. There is music, dance, appearances by local artists, politicians, government officials, and participants from many faiths. With Her Holiness Shinzo Ito, spiritual leader of Shinyo-en, leading the ceremony. The climactic moment is the launching of the lanterns at sunset. Floating lanterns lit by candles, inscribed with names and messages, set out to sea. For most, this is the emotional high point of the day. With hugs, tears, and smiles, individual lanterns are set on the water and gently floated away from shore. With a Buddhist organization as the founding sponsor, the lantern floating event is especially sensitive to protecting the environment and to staging a peaceful and harmonious event that is respectful of all faith traditions. Cleanup efforts are meticulous, and even the lanterns are captured, returned ashore, and reused in subsequent years so that they do not add to the pollution that plagues our coastlines. As the scope of the project has steadily grown since 1999, there is more and more opportunity for collaboration with a full range of public and private sector organizations. In our world of cloud computing, instant communications, world news, and community turmoil, the Shinyo Lantern Floating Ceremony offers inspired moments of calm, healing, altruism, well-being, and hope.